Hi, my name is Dr. Jerry Smith and I'm from Lafayette, Louisiana. Um, back in 1992, uh, myself and Dr. Carl Bro and our wives, uh, Jermaine and Monica, uh, came down to Atiyak for the first time to provide dental care for some of the poor which do not have access to dental care in this area, in the state of Guerrero. Uh, the first trip was a pretty arduous one in that we didn't have any dental facilities and, and of course the patients were here by the hundreds so the hours were long and the work was very difficult but uh, it was very gratifying. It was at that point that we realized that the need for care in this area was far beyond our expectations. We returned a year later with another dentist and provided the same level of care. Subsequent to that, the construction of the medical dental clinics as well as the operating room, the dormitory, the kitchen, the optometry clinic as well as the recovery room for patients began. This, of course, took quite a bit of time and quite a bit of vision, but thanks to the volunteers and the funds that were solicited and donated to this cause, uh, everything has come to fruition. After 20 years of having been involved in this mission, we find ourselves in a situation where we have groups traveling here on a regular basis for a variety of services. For instance, there's a water, there are water well teams from throughout the United States and Canada that come down here to provide water in many of the villages that do not have access to fresh, clean water. In addition, we have a medical dental campaign which occurs annually, which involves general surgery as well as plastic surgery, orthopedic surgery, and overall medical care to some of the patients in this area. We have patients that come from as far as 10 to 15 hours by bus in order to seek this type of care. In addition, Dr. Ed Grawl from Eunice, Louisiana provides ophthalmology care for patients in this area who otherwise cannot receive such care. When we have a medical dental campaign, our optometrists will see somewhere around 400 patients over the course of the week. Dr. Romero, Dr. Obanyan, and the rest of the surgical team and nurses will operate on anywhere from 50 to 60 patients during the course of the week. The dental team will see somewhere between 300 to 400 patients during the course of that week as well. Because of the fact that some of the people in the surrounding villages, particularly those up in the mountains, cannot take off of work to come to Antioch to receive dental care, we've assembled a mobile dental team which allows us to be able to bring dental equipment along with generators, vacuum machines, compressors and so forth so that we can set up in these villages in order to provide care for the people who are unable to return to Atayak. Porque pues aquí pues habemos mucha gente que nos faltan los recursos para eso y, y pues este, es una bendición de Dios que haya venido esto. Sí. La niña me decía, ay mamá, eso te ves muy feo, así como ella. Ayer que me miró con los dientes dice, mamá, eso te ves diferente. Sí.
again, you help us so much. And then there are so many needs here in Mexico. And not very many people do what you do. So thank you very much. Please keep coming. Keep helping us. And I know the Lord sent you to us. So thank you again. Thank you for everything. Thank you for all your help. And God bless you all. I'm very humbled as well as grateful for what we've been able to accomplish largely through donations and volunteers over the years. In spite of the fact that we come down here several times a year, we are only able to serve a very small segment of the population. And it's going to be through donations and volunteerism in the future that will enable us to continue to see this ministry forward. If you would like to become a part of this, please go to the donations tab on the Latin World Ministries website and we would appreciate your support.